In this video today, we're going to be talking about even and odd functions. Uh, the definition, or basic definition here, is if a function is even, then evaluating it for f of negative x, and you wind up getting the exact same thing as the original, then it's an even function. If a function is odd, then evaluating it for f of negative x, you get the exact opposite of the original functions, which in layman's terms is when it means that all the signs have been flipped. All the positives are negatives, all the negatives are positives. So we have three examples here today. f of x is equal to 2x to the fourth plus x squared. So if I evaluate that now for f of negative x, that means wherever I see an x, I'm going to plug in a negative x. So I have 2 times negative x to the fourth plus negative x squared. And if I look at that, I know that any time I have something to the fourth power, that's four negatives, that's going to wind up canceling out. I'm going to wind up with, again, 2x to the fourth. And then plus, if I square something that's negative, that's a negative times a negative, I'm going to wind up with x squared. So this is the exact same thing as the original function. Therefore, we know that this is even. Over here, we have f of x is 5x cubed minus 4x. So again, I'm going to plug in negative x to the equation. So I have 5 times negative x cubed minus 4 times negative x. And if I evaluate this, if I have a negative that's cubed, that's a negative times a negative times a negative. I'm going to wind up with negative 5x cubed and then a negative 4 times a negative x is going to be a positive 4x. So this is almost the same thing as the original, but all the signs are flipped. Therefore, we know this one is an odd function. And finally, our last one here, we have 4x squared plus 6x. So again, if I plug in negative x, I get 4 times negative x squared plus 6 times negative x. I know that if I square something that's negative, it's going to wind up being positive. So I got 4x squared, and 6 times a negative x winds up being negative 6x. Now, the only sign that's flipped is the middle one, but they have to all be flipped. So therefore, this one is a neither. When we talk about it, if it's either it's even, odd, or neither. So there's three quick examples of how to determine whether a function is even, odd, or neither.